you remember the golden rule you were taught as a child? Do unto others as you would have them do unto you. Most of our parents were teaching us that we needed to treat other people the same way we wanted to be treated. We were to share our toys with others because we wanted them to share their toys with us. We weren't to kick or punch others because we didn't want them to kick or punch us. Jesus himself taught us this important principle in Matthew 7, verse 12, and it applies whether you're a kid on the playground or an adult on the job. But did you know that in his word, God has another golden rule? It's one that specifically applies to sowing uncommon seeds and reaping God's uncommon harvest. It's found in Ephesians chapter 6, verse 7 and 8, and it says, With good will, doing service as to the Lord and not to men, knowing that whatever good anyone does, he will receive the same from the Lord. Whatever good anyone does, he will receive the same from the Lord. In other words, what you make happen for others, God says he's going to make happen for you. And the Bible is full of stories that demonstrate this principle. God blessed Abraham and Sarah with a child of their own after they prayed for God to remove barrenness from the king's household. God honored King David's life after he honored the life of King Saul. God gave Nehemiah authority and resources for rebuilding Jerusalem's walls after he faithfully served in the house of a pagan king. You know, we're to serve the Lord by doing good things for others. And when we do, the Lord says he's going to do good things for us. When we sow uncommon seeds of our time, your time, your talent, your treasure into people's lives, you reap his uncommon harvest. And as you bless others, your family, your friends, your pastor, your church, your co-workers, your boss, and yes, even your enemies, God blesses you abundantly in return. From his vast wealth throughout the whole universe, God pours out his blessings on his children who are walking in a loving, obedient, faith-filled covenant relationship with him. A covenant relationship that includes God's eternal principle of sowing and reaping, of seed, time, and harvest. And as you sow into the lives of others, you will reap God's harvest in your own lives. 